what's up everyone happy day after fourth of july get you the view while we let some friends join us we're down here in west hampton hanging out down by the water we got the big flag rocking in the background today everybody's sleeping everyone's hung over that's it, that's it. Monday morning day after 4th of July. It's not raining. Where is everybody today? Someone's got to be awake. Yeah. Everyone's sleeping today. All right, we'll go with the message anyway. You can watch it on the replay. All right, all right. So down here by the water, West Hampton, and a uh, little east meets west. We got some Malvern friends down here. Morning. Larry and Derek came on for the ride all the way out from Malvern to join me out here in the Hamptons for our We Ride at Dawn 365 Live. So we're out here by the water. Hanging out with this big giant flag in the background for uh, in honor of uh, Independence Day. So uh, yesterday's message about uh, being free and uh, independent uh, and our thoughts and our actions in life. So uh, today's message, uh, a little mix of, um, I was listening to um, Ryan Stewman, of course, usually get him every morning, and uh, Steve Weatherford, a little mix of uh, two different podcasts. And um, Ryan's message was uh, stop resisting. You know, people, uh, when they're getting arrested, they say uh, stop resisting. And uh, they don't, and they make the situation worse rather than just, uh, you know, just basically uh, surrendering to, uh, to the officer and, um, and then, you know, dealing with it later in court. So in life, uh, we resist a lot um, and we don't surrender to what needs to happen. And the longer we resist, the harder we make it on ourselves. Um, and then uh, Steve Weatherford, common topic they talk about is choosing your hard. So um, <clears throat> basically, uh, you know, getting up every morning, 5.45, riding at 6 a.m., it's hard. Um, but uh, everyone seems to resist. I mean, of course, Larry and Derek didn't resist today. But um, many people are resisting. Um, the things they need to do in their life. Um, we need to exercise and, you know, a lot of people resist it. A lot of people choose to, uh, you know, have the extra drink, have the extra cheeseburger and don't get up and don't exercise. And they're choosing their hard, you know, being overweight, um, is hard. Dieting is hard. Um, you know, not exercising, um, and getting out of breath when you go up and down the stairs is hard. Getting up in the morning to ride your bike is hard. Um, getting up to go to work every day is hard. Being broke is hard. Um, basically choose your heart and uh, don't resist what needs to happen. You got to do the work. Um, <clears throat> you know, if you're at work and you're, uh, you're not doing your job and you're resisting, um, resisting going the extra mile, um, you're never going to excel and by not excelling, you struggle to pay your bills. You struggle to, uh, you know, live the life the way you want to live it because you're not putting in the work. You're resisting doing the work. You're resisting the change. You're existing, resisting learning to better yourself. Um, we all know that we have things in life that we need to do. We need to read that book. You know, we need to go to the gym. We need to take that course. We 
need to, uh, you know, get that promotion. We need to start that business. Uh, there's a lot of stuff in life that we resist. And uh, by resisting, we don't get to where we need to be. And, uh, you know, we, we got to choose our heart. We got to choose, you know, it's hard to go to school. It's hard to take that class. It's also hard not to be able to pay the bills. So a little combination today of both uh, don't resist what we need, we know we need to do in our lives. Um, and to, uh, you know, when you choose our heart, everything in life is hard. Uh, so choose your heart, you know, choose your heart that's going to get you benefit or choose your heart that's just going to keep you in the same place where you're at. Either way, it's hard, but choose the hard with the best outcome. So uh, Benny's on. That's, Benny's down in uh, Mexico. Let's see if we can get Benny on live. That'll be different. Let's talk about South meets North. Can you get on, Benny? Let's see if this works. No, maybe. Let's see if we can get on from Mexico. We've never done a live from Mexico. It's a whole new beast right here. I don't know what's going to happen, Benny. I don't know. I'll see if Benny can get on. So, anyways, that's the message. Benny? Live from Mexico. What is up? What's going on? It's probably costing like $8 a minute right now. No, no, no. <laughs> no, no, no. I made sure that I, I had uh, I had coverage. So I'm actually on their Wi-Fi, so it's good. There you go. Uh, let's see this. Hold on. Let's see if they're up. Hold on so one second. Like I am in the... Well, this is what we're going to do today. Today is my, birth, my son's birthday. And right. yeah, they're they're out. Hold on one second. I, my my uh, hotel room faces the Dolphins, oh, which man. we are gonna be with them. Flip this thing around. Uh, I can. Swimming with the Dolphins. This is this is the Dolphin tank. Actually, they are coming this way. Hold on. Uh -huh. You see them? You see them in the end over there? There's, there's fins coming out of the water. They're all the way at the end of, like, in that area. All right, all right. That's cool. That's so, a little treat today. Wanna, it's actually beautiful here today. Um, yesterday was beautiful. We had a really, really cool um, fireworks show for, you know, for the Americans that are here, which is yeah. cool. I'm doing my daily, my daily walk. So... so I'm gonna listen to Motivational Monday with Ryan Stuman. Do my walk. Do my live with you. Um, so we got uh, we got some visitors here. You know these uh, these visitors here. Who's that? Hey, who's that? Father? Yeah. And his, father and his brother. My man. Uh -huh. What's up? What's up, guys? Father family here. <laughs> That's good. You, you still in the Hamptons? Still in the Hamptons. Yeah, they came all the way out to ride with me. Well, they live. Well, they do. They have a house out there. Good morning. Yeah. I know. I don't feel that much. They do, it. but you know, it sounded good. Get a ball. <laughs> they they want to they want to do that ride at dusk. Ride at dusk, yeah. <laughs> no, no, we ride at dawn. Ride at dawn. I know, but they they wanted to do something else. But um, oh, let's see if I could do this walk over here. Come up for a ride. Don't drink the water. No, drink nothing but. Not the water. No, no, drink bottled the water, bottled water. Drink bottled the Kool-Aid now. <laughs> so what's going on? I, 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 sorry, I, I didn't catch the, the message. Okay. What's going on today? Well, I message about. Uh, You know, we getting in shape. Make it hard. Good morning. Hard to, uh, you're out of shape, but you make fat and you can't breathe. And, you know, bad mindset. I'll try to do it every morning to take your exercise. That's right. Well, Steve Weatherford, and he was talking about, he talked a lot about the topic that comes up. So, uh, it's hard, but um, it's hard. Being fat and fat is 
hard, but exercise is also hard. But the hard with the exercise, get the result that makes it less hard. So choose your hard. Um, you know, it's pretty common. Average, what's of average convinces us that hard and uh, makes us resist. And Definitely, definitely. Um, I mean, look, even on vacation, uh, I had to get up. I had to do my daily walk, you know, do stuff for me, and then later on we do stuff for the family. So no matter what, you still got a time block and do what you got to do. This, um, this little journey that I'm on is, is for me. Um, it's, just, it's just a daily. You know, I was like the... Uh, the excuses were about to hit me. Oh, I'm yeah. like, nah, I got to get up. I got to get up. So what I did was I put my son's presence on the table and I said, you know what? And then I just saw, I clicked on Facebook and I saw that you were live and I'm like, oh, he's on. So I'm out. <laughs> I got to go. <laughs> got to go, man. Got to go. Got to do it every day. Uh, yeah. All right. We got to get the time because now we're ready. To <laughs> Who are you putting on the spot? Represent. Look at that. Hempstead Country Club, too. Look at that. He's representing. There we go. We're representing. I got to I gotta rep represent here. Yeah, Lions Not Sheep. Sean Whalen, my man. Hung out with him. <laughs> Uh, you're coming in choppy. Oh man, hope I'm not losing my signal like usual. No. Up? I, I, you're coming in choppy. So oh, that's not good. We're doing our prayers or what? Let's do our prayers. Hopefully everyone can hear us. All right, all right. Ready? Yes. Our Father, Lord in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Be thy name. Thy the kingdom come. Will be done. Give us this day our daily day bread. Day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Let us not into temptation. Deliver us from evil. Amen. to do every day, live our life to the fullest. And I can't. Uh, uh, coming in choppy. Uh, yeah, you know what? When we go when we go dual screen like this. It's really All right, I'm gonna sign. Yeah. Pull up. Mexico. Yeah, I give. A beautiful view for the morning. 
Yeah, you're chopping them now too. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. All right, good hopping on with you, man. I'm gonna continue on my journey. Have a great day. The fodders, good to see you. Yeah, we're losing our signal now. All right, brother, be good. All right, all right. Hopefully the volume was all right for all that. Again, um, our thoughts and prayers go out to Tommy Winter's family. Um, we lost a great guy, kind of sad, Melbourne family. So uh, think about him and his family today. Think about uh, all the people he's touched in the world. Um, Carpe dia, man. That's it. Live your life to the fullest every day. Make every minute count. Right, everyone, God bless. Have a good week, good day. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow morning. We ride at dawn, 6 a.m. All right, tomorrow we'll be live at 6.30. So uh, we'll